Hi, thank you for your question. So yes, when it comes to like being trans, being gay, whatever, definitely I get some hate from like certain demographics more. But let me tell you something, I 110% believe that if I was like still presenting as a woman on here, um, or a feminine woman, I should say, I think I would get way more hate than I do now. Women are so mean to each other. And here's the thing that has always just stunned me. The biggest culprits when it comes to which women are the meanest to each other are big women to other big women. Now, I know people are going to get up in arms, but wait. I spent a long time presenting as a bigger woman. Oh, maybe I should say this in case people are confused. I'm a trans man. Um, I was assigned female at birth, um, but this is me when I was presenting as a woman before my medical transition. I've been like an average size slash, to me that's thin, but I get that like to some people it'd be an average size woman. I have also been a very thin woman. And it was always like, um, just jarring to me. How like, literally my biggest bullies when I was a fat woman were other fat women. Or maybe they'd be like 15 pounds less than me. So, like, it was okay to call me a fat bitch because, uh, they were, like, you know, a half size less. When I lost a shit ton of weight because I had lost, like, uh, over 150 pounds, I was, like, so resentful at the male population because it was just fucking sick. Like, dudes who, like, grew up, like, you know, shitting on me all of a sudden gave me the time of day. All of a sudden, when I met up with dudes, I didn't have to worry about meeting them in person and they wouldn't like me. No, because I was skinny. I was skinny, so it didn't matter. If you take even a semi-angled picture, like, when you're, like, an overweight woman, dudes will act so surprised when you meet them like you're a fucking catfish. That is your own damn fault that you can't determine if a chick got some weight on her, my dude. Like, how can you not, like, I don't even want to continue this date due to your own stupidity. I can't be seen with someone that unintelligent. No, but for real, that made me so fucking heated. I'm sure other women can attest that when you lose a shit ton of weight and you're living in society, like, as a feminine woman, like, you know, back then, like, I was dating men, like, you know, uh, cis men. It's a whole different experience, and it's enraging. It doesn't matter how much of a shitbag you are. It does not matter how unstable in general you are. It does not matter if you have disgusting habits. If you're thin and uh, considered, you know, acceptable in society's eyes, then uh, a lot of dudes out there, that's all they care about. You're good enough to show off. But uh, during this period, I really expected women to be, like, horrible to me. Because, I mean, they always tell you, like, if women are, like, shitheads to you, they must be jealous of you. So I thought, oh, well, now that, like, I'm thin, you know, because to me, being thin was everything because I had never been thin before. I thought, this is going to be bad. Like, women are going to fucking hate me. No, they treated me better. What the fuck? So I had this one experience, and it was wild. I was at a party with my baby's daddy, right? And this is what I looked like. And there was a girl there who I had went to school with. She was a nice girl. She wasn't like a shitbag or anything. She knew me in school like when I looked like this. Like this is, that's me. I, I'm i pretty sure I either was in high school or I just got out of high school. But anyway, she ended up uh, seeing me at the party like, you know, when I was uh, really thin. And she pulled my baby's daddy aside and she was like, oh my God, what happened? Is she okay? She literally said to him, oh my God, she used to be so thick. I used to be so jealous of her. And here I was, getting made fun of all the time for being fat, and somebody was jealous of me? Wish I had known that! But yeah, it was just wild to me, like, uh, the shift in how people treated me, uh, when I was thin. And there a hundred percent is a difference between presenting as a feminine woman and being big, and being big as I am now. Even back before I transitioned when I was a masculine lesbian, being overweight, much different experience than... You see me on here, like, doing a lot of cooking videos, eating videos. I show tons of takeout that we get, you know, on days I don't feel like cooking. And people might once in a great while be like, you know, oh, your family is huge, or you're a fat ass. But I very rarely get comments like that. People very rarely comment on my weight in a negative manner. I do get a lot of, like, anti-LGBT comments, but I really truly feel... That uh, if I presented as a woman and I was on here, I'd have a Reddit page about me already. I'd have people swarming my comments about, you know, how I'm so unhealthy, how I never want to better myself, and blah, blah, blah. Because I see it on women's videos. I mean, they'll do the same things I do and they'll get shit on. And sometimes the people shitting on them follow me. So I block them, of course. But yeah, I do notice an uptick in hate, obviously, like being LGBT, but I've... 
you know, the first time I came out, I was like probably 14 years old. So <laughs> I've been dealing with this a long time. I grew up in a rural area, like I'm used to it. I definitely think there would be a much uh, higher contrast in hate um, if I presented as a bigger woman. Because honestly, that was a time in my life where like, I just, I'm really disgusted how people acted. I'm so glad they have like body positivity and stuff now. Um, but I think it seems like it's gone further than it really has, honestly. So hopefully it keeps going.